Hey guys, so I have a cool little treat for you today. We're gonna be playing the Arby's Greek Euro games. Now, what is this exactly you're probably asking? Well, it's a silly take on 90s 8-bit games, and if you complete the 26.2 mile virtual marathon, you will get a coupon for a free Arby's Euro. And don't worry, if you don't make it that far, you can at least get yourself a 10% off coupon at the halfway mark. Thank you so much to Arby's for reaching out and for sponsoring today's video. Let's get going. All right, so let's start the Arby's Greek Gyro, or Gyro as I say, which I know probably is incorrect, games. <gasps> We're at an Arby's. The flame on the Gyro broiler is out. And for some reason, it's 26.2 miles away. Take this and go light it. Press the right arrow button. Okay. So we're just going to be using the keyboard. Ooh. <laughs> I like how there's a give up button. Aw, oh, thanks for the encouragement, dude. Alright. Oh, treadmill. As if there wasn't a lot of running already, this poor guy has to get on a treadmill. Yeah, what's the treadmill doing here? What am I getting into? Okay, there's good old Coca-Cola. There's a lot of people watching us. Another one. This poor guy, I could not run this much. Because I'm an asthmatic. This guy clearly is very athletic. I like this little guy, he's cute, he has his little hat on, his little apron. I think I see a mustache. So he's a quite he's quite a hip dude, isn't he? I'm really scared. What if this is the whole game? Oh, wait, I see things in the field. Are those daisies? Whoa, you're exhausted, help. Oh. He's still holding that torch. Okay, yes, yes, help. <gasps> Get your ice cold Powerade! Aw, oh, thanks, man! She's so helpful! Okay, so now we're fueled with some Powerade, and now we're ready to keep going. They don't give you Powerade in track and field. So, when Arby's reached out, I had to say yes, because if you guys have been with me from the beginning of my channel, about three years ago, the first time I streamed Castlevania, um, a lot of Arby's talk was happening. People kept mentioning curly fries, and you know, because your power-ups are meat. People would be like, it's Arby's time, and now it's just, it's all come full circle, and it's really crazy. But this just felt right. I feel like this song is going to be haunting my dreams tonight when I try to sleep, if I can sleep. But there is that coupon. There's two coupons, and we're going to get them. So that's my incentive. Oh no, another treadmill. So these are just to like slow you down? That's brutal. Oh my god, an alien! Are we gonna get abducted? I just wanna fix the broiler. Like, come on. Now I gotta worry about aliens? Yes, I'm even more exhausted than I was when I was doing the track and field power pad game. Oh, we got a Coke now. I wonder what other kind of treats we're gonna get. I hope she brings us, like, curly fries. Like a big old bucket of curly fries. It's probably not the best thing to eat and then go running right after, but whatever. This is an alternate Arby's universe. Curly fries! We got curly fries! Yes! Look how cute that little icon is! Oh, another treadmill. Step off! Maybe it's the aliens putting the treadmills down, because how else would they get in the middle of the track? So this also reminds me of Summer Games on Atari. And here's some good old track and field for the power pad. You know, oh, there's that alien again! See, I'm no stranger to track games, but I want to know what that alien's about. The meat. It's a good soundtrack. A bit repetitive, but you know. Ugh. Please, please change. Please change the atmosphere. This might be the ultimate troll game. Because it knows you're going to finish it because you want the coupons. But like... Come on, you gotta, you gotta give us something. What if in Castlevania, instead of whipping walls for meat, you had an Arby's truck pull up and you could choose between various beverages and snacks? I feel like um, the Belmont clan would have done better if they were powered by curly fries. Better than wall meat. <gasps> One eighth done! Okay. We're getting there. Oh no, another treadmill. Alright, now what are you going to bring us? Coke? She only has Coke 
Powerade and curly fries. Give me a beef and cheddar. I wonder what his name is. Did they say a name in the beginning? I feel like he looks like a Chuck. Or a Charles, perhaps. Go fix that broiler, Charles. I bet something will happen at the 30 minute mark. That's seven minutes away. Cause that's like half an hour. Coupon time. Let's get coupons. Come on, I am going to make lyrics to this song. I wonder what the coupon will look like. Oh my god, that'd be really cute if it's like still in the kind of like 8-bit style. If they make the coupon look like, you know, like a theme to this game, I would really appreciate that because that'd be really cute. I really hope they explain the lore behind the treadmills. They just pop up out of nowhere. I, I know it, it has to be that alien. Who knows, are those even people in the stands? They could be aliens. One thing that makes me laugh when you first start the game, and I forgot to comment on it because I was so taken aback, just this awful sound, like static sound. And I was like, oh my god, is this gonna be through the whole game? Why am I so tired? Every time it asks me that, it's like they're just, oh, we got a beef and cheddar! Things are looking up! Do you like how excited I got when um, he was given a beef and cheddar? I was just like, oh, something different! Oh my goodness! Oh my god, okay. 30. Nothing changed. We're 30 minutes in and nothing changed. Maybe at the 50% mark, it'll change? Oh no, I don't know what to think. I don't know. I thought I knew what I was getting into, and I totally didn't know. Eat this beef and cheddar, quick! That's huge. How, how does he eat it? Let alone that fast. It's bigger than his head. This guy's crazy. Is he even human? Maybe he's the alien, and then his friend is in the spaceship trying to get him back. How long are these people willing to watch us run? Or what if they're like really into it and on the edge of their seats? What if they have like little flags and they're eating popcorn? There's a guy selling hot dogs and cotton candy? What if it's a great time in the stands? What if it's a lot of support and that's why he's still going? You know what, I always thought he was wearing sneakers, but when I really look, they kind of look like Crocs. Is this guy running a marathon in Crocs? So I guess the thing you could do to have a faster time, slightly faster time, is click, you know, for help really fast. Get going the minute you can. Have your finger on that arrow button to go after you pound that Coca-Cola. And, you know, jump off of those treadmills as fast as possible. But, I mean, I guess it's fine if your time goes up. I don't know. But if you want to be a real speed demon about it, that's what you can do. Oh my god, 49.23% done! Oh my god, we're so close. We're so close. I'm nervous. Like, what's gonna happen? I'm actually kind of nervous. Is that weird? <laughs> like, what if something loud happens or scary? <laughs> what if it's a jump scare? Remember those jump scare chain letters? Uh, memories. Middle school memories. Okay, 50% done. Half done. Oh, oh, oh. Use Greek 10 for 10% off your order at Arby's. Dot rbshop.com. Okay, okay, I'm gonna screen cap you. That's cool. I thought like a literal coupon would appear, but I'm into that. So it's a billboard, and then that give up button is still taunting me, and I'm not gonna click it. Damn, this is a good endurance test, you know? I need to readjust myself while holding the button down. Oh, hey, I did it. <laughs> so there's already people that have beaten me. I see a lot of people have completed this in an hour and four minutes. I'm not entirely sure. I don't know if that means they gave up about an hour into it or if they beat it somehow, but we will see. I want my name on a leaderboard at 100%. I'm going to want fireworks. I'm going to want like a really big coupon. I'm having flashbacks to like... Not when I beat Batman on NES, but the first time I did a video on it, I like got to the Joker, but I didn't beat him. I remember I had to leave my NES on overnight, and I was terrified, and that took me like, oh my gosh. I want to say like six hours to record. It took me that long to get to where I was, because I kept dying and I'd have to go back. And this is like, wow, this is reminding me of that day. <laughs> We're 90.32% done. 
23 miles we've done. Oh my gosh. We're so close. We're so close. I'm scared. Oh my God. What's going to happen? We are so close. 95% done. I wonder how many curly fries we've consumed over um, this marathon. And beef and cheddars, Powerades and Cokes. Probably a lot. Surprised he hasn't had to go to the bathroom. Or maybe he has, and we don't know it. I've been playing this for two hours and 15 minutes, and this has been the screen the entire time. Like, this is it. It's almost like Desert Bus or something. <laughs> 98% done. <gasps> Less than 2% left to go. Oh my goodness. So close. So close. So close. You can do it. You can do it. I wonder if this will be our last Coca-Cola of the game. I don't know. Probably not. I think we're going to need a refreshment maybe two more times. We'll see. 99% <gasps> done. Less than a percent left to go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? What's going to happen? I'm so scared. Oh my gosh, like what if my power goes out or something? I'm so scared right now. Like, we're so close. I'm so scared. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my gosh. Okay, why are you so tired? <laughs> One final refreshment. Okay, we got our power aid. Okay, I wonder if the coupon... Oh my god, we did it, we did it, we did it. Oh my god, we did it. <gasps> the winner is you! <laughs> we lit the meat! Euro spits are not kept outdoors on ceremonial platforms and are not lit by employees that have been running. <gasps> There's fireworks! Hey, it's you. We have been expecting you. Everything in your life has led to this moment, and we couldn't be more proud. <gasps> you have done the impossible. Arby's is proud of me. An entire video game while forgetting all about your other responsibilities. Uh-huh. Everyone believed in you every step of the way, even when they didn't. You are now the proud owner of victory. Yeah. Coupon. Yes. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <gasps> the, the alien. He's here. They didn't let me down. <gasps> I was not expecting that ending. That was a good ending. Okay, so we ran the marathon in, let's see, okay, so we ran the marathon in 2 hours, 20 minutes, 11 seconds. Okay, well let's claim our prize. There it is! There is the coupon! Look how majestic it is. <gasps> was his name Doug? Is that the guy? The whole time his name was Doug! So there's your coupon. You can get a free Euro sandwich. <sighs> I hope you had fun. Oh, you know what? I heard that you can use the Konami code and go twice as fast. And once you beat it, you can go backwards. So I'm going to see if that works. Now this only works on the desktop version, so let's see. And also, if you go backwards, you can avoid treadmills. So let's see if this works. We can go backwards. <laughs> and it's going in negative time. That's funny. Alright, I hope you guys had fun watching me complete the 26.2 mile virtual marathon. I've never even completed a real life marathon, so this is like a really big moment for me. Thanks again to Arby's for sponsoring this video, and I hope you guys try out the game. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I'll be back again very soon. Bye!